I got to ask you about Top Chef. Obviously, you were the first top, true Top Chef master, which right. everyone around here was extremely excited about. That's cool. Yeah, and now we've got our own guy on the on the regular show. Right, Josh right. Valentine is doing really yeah. well right now. Yeah. Still, uh, still moving forward. What can you tell people about that show that they might not realize? <clears throat> well, it's reality TV, and we have all heard lots of things about reality TV, about how unreal it really is and how scripted it is. And I have to say, I went in with a little trepidation thinking, are they going to force me to do this or that? And is it going to just sort of be silly after a while? None of that is part of the Top Chef world. And I always say it's because regular cooking is dramatic enough. Right. And it, it, it's the, the pressure of that show is so intense that it creates its own drama. You don't really have to do that. And certain parts of people's personalities, even the show that I was on, really sort of come to the fore. Mm -hmm. Now, the one thing that they were really surprised about when we started Top Chef Masters is that, first of all, we all knew each other sure. and we were all friends. Yeah. And we all went on there to make, to make sure that it, uh, we, we were watching each other. We didn't want anyone to look bad. Right. I think it's changed a bit I in that much, some yeah. of the Top Chef Masters yeah. seasons after mine, but the beginning one, we were really invested in making sure everybody looked great. And they were surprised that there wasn't more drama. And I, I wanted to say to them, it's like, but you got all these people here that number one, are really good chefs. Mm -hmm. So we didn't have a lot to prove. We had already proven all that stuff. Right. And number two, most of us were very media savvy. I mean, we'd been sure. on TV a sure. lot. Sure. So we understood the, the whole thing. Now, whether or not we understood how to play that game, because it's right. a specific game. There are many really great chefs in the world that can't play that game at all. <laughs> they could cook me sort of completely out, but they couldn't do it in the format of the game. Mm -hmm. Okay. Absolutely. So I, yeah. I happen to love the game. It's, <laughs> it's actually a game I, I was used to playing with myself. Say I'm in the Walgreens in Chicago waiting to have a prescription filled. Well, I'll go into the aisles where they have food and say, now if I was thrown in here and told I had to make a meal, <laughs> what would I do <laughs> with this food and how could I make it into something that would be really great? So I, I love playing that, that kind of a game. Mm -hmm. So when I got to Top Chef Masters, I didn't know how real it would really be, it's real. <laughs> they tell you, this is your challenge and you gotta go do it. So there's a lot of pressure with that. And of course, what you don't understand because you get the installments mm -hmm. of it every week. Well, it's not a weekly thing, it's every yeah. day. You film every day until you're just done. <laughs> and boy, are you done when it's over because it's a, it's a lot of pressure, very long days. Mm -hmm. um, it's a lot of waiting around while they get all the technical stuff done. Mm -hmm. And then you're just waiting for your challenge, waiting for your challenge, waiting for your challenge. And then they give it to you and then you got to perform right there. And there's really wow. a clock on the wall and you got to do it. Yeah, and I think I think that's. Do you do you think that is why the the chef community has really sort of stayed behind that show? I mean, it, yes. it, is it so truly chef driven? It's truly chef driven, yeah. and it was the first one too to really do that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. No, well, I I take that back. Actually, I think certainly the Iron Chef that came from sure, Japan sure. was the first one to right. do that. <clears throat> but that's a different kind of it's a show. Theatrical, and yeah. it's very theatrical, and yeah. there is a whole lot of preparation that goes into it. Mm -hmm. You don't know what the ingredient is mm -hmm. that is going to be given to you, mm -hmm. but you know that it's going to be one of several things. So you've already it's planned some out plan, some yeah. stuff. Mm -hmm. You can't do an everything in one hour if you don't have if you haven't made any yeah. plans at yeah. all it just they wouldn't have a show right so there's a lot more uh, preparation that goes into mm -hmm. that one and then you get one shot at it and you're done it's not mm -hmm. like that ongoing thing mm -hmm. where there's elimination after elimination that's well it's we all very much enjoyed it as you as i'm sure you remembered i enjoyed it too <laughs> partly because i showed pretty well in it. That's it. <laughs>